All right, where do you go for an epic night out? In Osaka. No worries, I spent quite some time in Osaka, so I got you fully covered. Welcome to Osaka. Tonight, I'm going to show you the nightlife scene in the third biggest city of Japan. Osaka has two major nightlife districts where you will find the best bars and nightclubs in town. Umeda and Shinsaibashi. In this video, we're going to check out a few fun bars, grab some epic Osaka street food and party hard at the hottest nightclubs in town. Let's start off this nightlife adventure in the Umeda district at Captain Kangaroo. Captain Kangaroo is a great laid-back sports bar with cheap drinks, and fun games like darts. They do offer a great happy hours menu, which is great to kickstart your night. Interesting spot, but you have to come here during happy hour for some cheap eats and cheap drinks. Next, Umeda East Street. East Street is bustling with restaurants and bars. This street eventually leads to the unique bar, Median. This spooky bar is decked out with rock, metal and dark themes. Bar Median, the heavy metal bar of Osaka. I'm here with Funky sama and it's good rock music. Beautiful bar. Tons of selection of drinks. If you like metal music, then this bar is your spot. It's now time to cleanse my soul at this Christian bar. This is Kriston Bar. Great for evening snacks and drinks. They have a massive menu with affordable dishes. Prices are pretty good here. You know, for such a beautiful restaurant, this is not a bad deal. And this place is open until 5 a.m. 5 a.m., can you believe that? The main takeaway at Kristen Bar is their incredible decor, resembling a church with elements of a synagogue. Got a bunch of food here. We got a ham salad and some pizza. And of course, we're in Japan, so you're gonna do the high boru whiskey. But beware, the bar is handled by this suspicious individual. The most popular nightclub in the Umeda district is Ao Osaka. Men pay 2500 yen, 23 US dollars, while women pay 1000 yen, which is 9 US dollars and includes a drink ticket. Ao is a true Japanese nightclub since you won't find any foreigners here. So being able to speak a little bit of Japanese here is highly recommended. Ao does tend to get extremely busy, especially at the bar. Now, if you don't want to wait in line at the bar, I do have a drink vending machine. Next up, Dotonbori, located next to the Shinsaibashi district. The most touristy district in all of Osaka, loaded with incredible street food, restaurants and boat cruises. Walking around Dotonbori is a great pastime before you go out, especially if you like people watching and discovering secret alleyways. So the most famous object here in Osaka is the Griko Mon, right here at the Dotonbori Bridge. There's tons of tourists here and it's the main tourist attraction in Osaka. It's a true symbol and iconic place in the downtown heart of the city. My first tip for drinks here is the Moonwalk Bar. A famous bar where all drinks go for 200 yen and all food items for 300 yen, 3 US dollars. But this place does have a cover charge of 400 yen. 4 US dollars. 200 yen drinks, 300 yen food. That's amazing. It's kind of hidden. Most people won't find this, but it's, it has a very cozy patio. Across the street from the Moonwalk Bar is Rooftop Bar O. No, no, Rooftop Bar O. Ooh, Rooftop Bar O. Oh. Rooftop Bar O is a fantastic hidden rooftop in the heart of Osaka. This is a, yeah. What a cool place. Then we got a house. We got a beautiful yeah. house. Oh, and we gotta like crawl in order to get here. It's so crazy. A very cozy bar where you can meet many locals and enjoy a few drinks. <laughs> including shishas and great music. <laughs> Giraffe, considered the most popular nightclub in all of Osaka. Giraffe has three floors, epic beats, and a young crowd. The party here is pumping, but does have a downside because Giraffe closes early, usually around 2 a.m.
But I will tell you where you'll find the best after party in Osaka later in this video. Aren't lockers like the best thing about Japanese nightclubs? Hell yeah. Just, just have lockers everywhere. If you are curious to check out a 100% Japanese authentic rooftop bar, then pay a visit to the Betei rooftop bar next to Dotonbori. What? What? This is crazy! So from this spot, you can see the whole river, all the boats come by. This is a great place for a date. This place has an amazing atmosphere. Strong drinks, but above all, Eurobeat karaoke. Easy reaction in the night, get wild, my heart is burning. Hi, Osaka. Arigato mirasana. This is so cool. <laughs> This incredible bar even has a gorgeous garden on the terrace. And this bar is smack downtown Dotonbori. Nobody knows about this place, so try to keep this place a secret. Alright, now it's time for the most famous nightlife district in all of Osaka, Shinsai Bashi. In Shinsai Bashi, you will find by far the best bars and nightclubs. Now, if you do not speak a single word of Japanese and you're new to Osaka, then I highly recommend you join the Osaka Pop Crawl. Yeah! Which makes it incredibly easy to make new friends, enjoy a large array of free shots, and learn everything there is to know about the coolest hotspots in Osaka. Join a jam packed Osaka Pop Crawl Night for just 24 US dollars, which includes three bars and one epic nightclub twice a week. Special tip visit reformat.com to get an exclusive 20% discount on tickets. The Osaka Pop Crawl usually starts at the Blarney Stone for a few warm up shots. <laughs> then the party moves on to bars Domus in the America Mura district. As you can tell, I recorded this hilarious footage during Halloween. Halloween is the best time of the year to visit Osaka. Don't eat me! After Domus is life. Life is music, music. It's life. A hidden dive bar in one of the back alleys of Osaka, where the Osaka pop crawl bursts into dance off battles, <laughs> including foosball tables and darts. Ending the Osaka pop crawl at one of the most famous clubs in town, Sam and Dave, where the next platter of free shots was making its rounds. <laughs> A bear sets you back 500 yen, around 4 US dollars. Now one thing that's kind of interesting here, sometimes you have multiple places in one building. For instance, behind me here, I think there's like 40 different restaurants and places in one building. So always pay attention to the actual signs on buildings. During the Osaka Pop Crawl, I met up with local legends, Tony and Ryan. Total goofballs. <laughs> Luckily, Tony and Ryan showed me some of the best nightclubs in the Shinsaibashi district. First stop, Club Candy, a new and high-end club with some of the most gorgeous girls in all of Osaka. Next, the pink. It's so pink. As the name suggests, this nightclub has a completely pink atmosphere. Also, alcohol vending machines are common at nightclubs in Osaka. My favorite nightclub in Osaka is Adam. Adam is considered by many locals to be the best after party in town. Adam has a young crowd, some serious fish for sushi. What? You got fish at a nightclub only in Japan. It's like 5 a.m. But also the crocodile dentist game. <laughs> and of course, a large dance floor with epic beats. The entrance fee for Adam is 2,500 yen, 24 US dollars, but the party continues until 7 a.m. <laughs> If you like hip hop, rap, and RB, then check out Club Burke, which is most popular on Thursdays and also closes at 7 a.m. Now, if you still have some energy left, 
check out Bar Heaven. This is for many the final stop. Bar Heaven stays open until 1 p.m. So you can go straight to lunch after. Now, if nightclubs aren't your thing, check out Space Station in the America Mura district. All right, guys, this is the PC and retro bar. Massive assortment of everything retro and awesome old school games. Super Nintendo, Sega Genesis, you name it, they have it. This incredible bar offers a wide variety of classic video games, but also Dreamcast and classic Nintendo. This place is decked out with old arcade modder boards. Damn, look at that board, just for Frogger. And many cherished memories for any 80s and 90s fanatic. An old school favorite of mine, Chippendale. Awesome 8-bit Nintendo game. Make sure to order the Commodore 64 cocktail. Even next door you can play some Super Nintendo on the street. While you enjoy poisonous snake sake. Hi, 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 hi! Para, para, Last but not least, Garden Bar. Ah, come on, man. Timeless. Where you can go all out on Thursday night dancing to hyper fast Eurobeat music. <laughs> AKA Para Para. I personally love Eurobeat and dancing to it always puts a giant smile on my face and is one of my favorite ways to end the night. <laughs> For after party food, consider the amazing Fami Chiki. It's gonna be hot as hell. <laughs> Incredible deep fried chicken from Family Mart. So apparently, this is the most delicious thing at Family Mart. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Fami chicken, that man. It's so good. It's so fresh. So juicy. Yes. Boneless chicken. Straight from the fryer. KFC, eat your heart out. Holy moly. Or perhaps a hot steaming bowl of ramen on Dotenbori. Ramen, ramen, ramen. Wow. <laughs> Alternatively, get yourself some late night takoyaki. <laughs> Fried batter balls with a piece of octopus inside. Or a bowl of liquid broth from the convenience store with Japanese oden. With items ranging from juicy. Juicy eggs to meats. Very satisfying to say the least. Visit reformat.com to download my complete map with all the bars and nightclubs I mentioned in this video. Just click on the link that appears in the right corner of your screen, including photos, prices, discounts, and all my extra tips. And if you think I missed a good bar or nightclub here in Osaka, then please let me know by leaving a comment in the comment section below. Now, as always, these are my bonus tips. Check out the most bizarre hotel in all of Osaka, the Dotenbori Hotel. A great spot for selfies. Probably one of the most interesting buildings I've seen here in Osaka. These faces are huge. Probably put my whole fist up the nose. For a great place to stay, consider Hotel Grand Via in the Umeda district. <laughs> Or Hotel Unizo in the America Mura district, close to all the bars and nightclubs in Osaka. If you rather stay in an Airbnb, then check the links in the description box below for a sweet discount. The Japanese used the Line app for day-to-day -day communication, so stay connected at all times by renting a super fast pocket Wi-Fi station for just $6 a day, which works all over Japan. Check the link in the description box below for another sweet 30% discount on a Ninja Wi-Fi router. As a side note, English is not widely spoken yet in Japan, so if you don't speak a word of Japanese, then be sure to join the Osaka Pop Crawl, which makes socializing in Osaka a lot easier. In conclusion, I believe the Osaka nightlife is truly more welcoming than the Tokyo nightlife. So do not skip Osaka on your next adventure to Japan. Now go on, please like this video and subscribe and press the notification bell right next to it so you'll receive an automatic update every time I release a new video. Now also please help out The Reformat Show by sharing this video on all your social media or send it to all your friends that may consider of visiting Japan. See you in the next episode. Bye bye. Guess what? What I found here. Hotel Christmas in downtown Osaka. Hotel Christmas for lovers. So you can celebrate Christmas all year round. <laughs> it's also remarkable is the level of graffiti down here. That's not something you would see in Tokyo. Maybe that's an Osaka thing.